Did you guys feel any pressure heading into production for season two after getting so much critical acclaim for season one? Yes. The answer is yes. Um, yes, I myself, speaking for myself only, um, felt a tremendous amount of pressure. And just like, uh, you know, season one, I was v- uh, very much like in it, and it was just the work and the world was kind of on hold and shut down. And we were making this uh, production um, during the pandemic, and um, nothing had really come back yet. And since it came out, season one, you know, there's been this whirlwind of this world that is like, very new to me of the articles and the awards and all of these like various elements of the business that don't Mm -hmm. really like that are separate from the work itself Mm -hmm. and so all of that swirling around my head before the second season I was like whoa whoa what what you know (laughs) so it just kind of it it kind of um emphasized the fact that there were eyes on us um and so I really just tried to um, give it all I give it all I had, and um, I I put a lot of pressure on myself for sure. I mean I always do because I'm a perfectionist, but um, yeah, it I definitely felt like I put um, a lot of pressure on myself, but I think it turned out. You know, I kind of eased in. But also talk to us about why Ava's the only person in the world who would get sued and then be like. I'm going to be better. I'm going to make it work. <laughs> well, she just loves Deborah, and she knows that she f***ed up. So she's like, fine, like, this is my punishment. You know? <laughs> and how would you respond? Like, would you be as resilient and being like, I'll take it? Or would you be like, I'm out of here? I have to think that if she was keeping me on, but still suing me, I, I would, like Ava, assume that, you know, she wasn't serious. <laughs> 